Yeah, I feel I'm pretty much an old man at this point. Like, I don't want to sound negative here, but please understand me when I say this. It's only downhill from here. Up until 21, I was excited. Past 21, each year is like, damn it, damn it, damn it. Like, there's just nothing. Like, yes, I can get a car. I can rent a car in America when I'm 25, but that's pretty much it. And I'm not that excited about that, I'm gonna be honest. The idea of spending two, three hundred dollars a day to rent a car or whatever they'll be charging over there, not that exciting to me. So pretty much, not much excitement coming here. Not much excitement. No, I'm 23. Isn't the age of 25 the age when you could adopt a baby? Yeah, um, this, okay, this will be an actual shock, no cap, but I don't think I'm ready to adopt a baby. So I don't think it really matters to me that much. I know that that's gonna shock a lot of people because I'm like, I'm one of the most like responsible adults um, that you will have ever met or known, obviously. But, um, but, uh, but yeah, I don't think I'm ready to take care of a baby just yet. Speaking of babies, though, I actually, I actually did get a baby a couple of days ago. Uh, his name is Baby Yoda, and he's beautiful. I have a Baby Yoda plushie now that I got as a gift from Maisie, so I, I am, I am taking care of him really well. I actually have a lot of people. Um, I actually like, I actually have a couple of friends over right now, so, uh, so yeah, she's upstairs. Actually. Speaking of which, I feel really bad. I feel really, really, really bad because I feel like I've scammed you guys because I always say that if you ever see me in public, just be confident to come up and say hi because it's better to just come up and be confident than to just like later send me a DM saying I saw you at X place. I was too shy to say hi. Two days ago, I was in a grocery store and a worker that worked at this grocery store walked up to me and was like, Hey, Linkus. What's up? And I was like, not much. And then I stood there and just stared at him because he had such confidence. I've never seen someone with such confidence when they come up and say that, that I was like, do I know this person? Am I supposed to know who this is? And then I like looked at his face. I looked down at, at like his body, looked back up at his face. And I was like, oh, uh. I was like, am I supposed to know this person's name? And then he was like, oh, um, my username is, I'm a horrible person. Don't remember, it was something along with the names of Thor. Anyways, it was some, Th Thor something. And I was like, oh, hi, nice to meet you. And then he was like, gotta run. I felt really bad because I've never seen someone come up with such confidence and he's like, look at me like that. I was certain that I knew him. So I just had to like be like, oh God, what was like, do I know him? And here is something very sad. You might think that it's weird that I said that I looked down at his body. That is because I'm still not used to people coming up and saying hi to me in person outside of gaming events. That whenever someone comes up and says hi to me, I naturally look down to look for the badge. Because for so long, I've only got recognized at gaming events. My natural reaction to someone saying hi to me is looking down at their chest to see the badge to take a peek at their username. So that's why I took a peek down the second he said hi after looking at his face. And that's why I looked down. I was like, oh yeah, no badge. I can't look at the username. Because yeah, I'm, I'm not used to people coming up in public and saying hi. <laughs> no, I've never had a girl come up and say hi. Linkus, I love your stream. It's only dudes. Oh wait, I have a girlfriend now. <clears throat> no, I've never had any girls come up and say hi to me. Uh, but I don't really care about that, honestly. Like, bleh, I don't really see any difference about that nowadays. Anyways, <clears throat> I hope Maisie isn't watching the stream. <clears throat> Please tell me she doesn't have the stream on. I have a tradition for my birthday. I have a I have a tradition for my birthday that I've been doing ever since uh, 2015. Ever since 2015, I've done a birthday stream every single year. And I don't like to do a super long stream on my birthday because I have friends over and, you know, I don't want to be too antisocial. So ever since 2015, I have, by tradition, done a no reset Wind Waker run. So by tradition, today I'm going to be doing a no reset Wind Waker run. It's going to be any percent because, like I said, I'm going to do a super long one. However... Or I will do a Super Mario 64 70 star speed run. Uh, because my wrist, like I said, is quite mad because I, I must have slept in a bad posture or something. I must have said like this. So I will do a no reset Wind Waker run after talking to you guys, or I'll do an SM64 70 star. You sent me the picture? Yeah, do you want me to bring him down? Poggers. Did you bring him down now? No, but I can do it right now. Sure, yeah, do it. Alright, so chat. No, Hi, let me chat. So let me show you the chat. So, this is my new decoration in my kitchen right next to my coffee machine i have this 
He sits on my shelf right next to my coffee machine like this. This is my new favorite kitchen decoration. I got it for him for Christmas. We got a little baby Yoda in a coffee one. And there's obviously no coffee in this one. It's just decoration, but yeah. Can I do my Jar Jar Binks impression for chat? Sure, one time. You so strong! <laughs> Clumsy. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, bye. Happy birthday, bye Chad. Bye. <laughs> Anyways, um yeah, always kiss the homies goodnight. She's just a homie, Chad. Uh and you know, I always keep up with the tradition of kissing the homies goodnight. And she's going to bed right now, so yeah, I always kiss the homies. Just a homie. Uh I guess for anyone that doesn't know. Um, Maisie has been living with me in Sweden ever since March of 2021. So, uh, yeah, she's been, she's, uh, she's been upstairs for, um, for the past nine months. Uh, and I announced it, uh, right before Thanksgiving this year. So you're dating? Yes. I'm still impressed that you kept it a secret. Yeah. Oh, by the way, speaking of which, can I just say, I've had an influx of Twitter followers recently. And... I was very confused at first, because I haven't made that many tweets. I figured out why I've had an influx of followers on Twitter. It's because by random users on Twitter, I'm getting added all the time right now. Because the new Spider-Man movie is popping off so hard that the amount of random ads I'm getting saying, I couldn't stop thinking of Link is 7 the entire time I was watching a new Spider-Man movie has been so through the roof. That I'm getting like 10, 20 followers almost a day just from the ads of other people tweeting at me saying I couldn't stop thinking about Link 7 watching a new Spider-Man movie. Or like every time I saw Tom Holland, I was thinking of Link 7. Every single day it's happening. Maisie got sent to her from her dad. Her dad is not like a Twitch viewer, okay? He's like normie, right? Maisie's dad sent a text message saying this. I just saw the Spider-Man. First of all, greatest mo uh, greatest Spider-Man movie ever. Second, I think you're living with Spider-Man, dude. All the way through, all I could think about was this dude looks like Linus. He doesn't even know the meme! He doesn't even know the meme about me looking like Tom Holland! That was like an out of the blue text! I can't get away from it! I it's, it's inescapable at this point. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna go- I guess this is a no reset run, Chad. Uh, let's just, uh, let's just not use splits. I'm not gonna PB anyways, trust me. Uh, let's start this in three, two, one. Oops, wrong button. That's fine, still valid. It's been a long time since I ran this, so hopefully I still remember the route. That's the only thing that I'm like Monka W about right now, is just the route. Everything else I'm confident about. Thank you. I was like mod checking there. <laughs> Oh my dog. <laughs> that scared the living bazooka out of me. Why did I just say living bazooka? Hello? What what I what what is that expression? You know what? I'm roll I'm 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 rolling with it. Dude, that scared the living bazooka out of me. <laughs> Honestly, I wanna say poggers, but I more feel bad for him, because I'm gonna be honest. Anyone that has a birthday in December can confirm this. Having your birthday close to Christmas, honestly, not Pog. Trust me when I say it's honestly not Pog. Va, va, ex, ex, excuse me, Manan. How was that not on the door? Are you for real right now? You're telling me that was not on the wall. Link is you're gonna die? Nah, easy clap, boys. All right, don't fail this cutscene, Skip. I didn't pick up any hearts, so it would be really sad if I missed this. Thank you, sir. We got him. All right, let's see. Can we be the Swedish sniper, Chad? One. Really? That was too high up? Weird champ. Oh, he moved right as I shot. So bad. Oh, so bad. Oh, got the frame perfect trip shot. We take those. Oh, God, no. 
No! Oh my god! Holy shit! Oh, we got the trog shot! Oh my god! Oh, what a giga chad! Please give me good RNG, go backwards. Oh, saved. Oh my god. Holy shit. Whew. I got a bad angle and I just try to save it and somehow it got picked up. I don't know how the hell we got that to work, but we take those. All right, Woo. All right, beautiful. Honestly, super good run. This was not even a bad run at all. This was actually like, except for the fairy clip, this was a solid as hell run. It's a good run. And time. Easy clap, boys. There we go. 42-14, that's really good. G G, except for the sloppy fairy clip, that was a really good run. We take those. G G.